Ben de İncil'den sevgiyle ilgili bir söz vermek like istiyorum. E, sonra, Part from the gospel about love and I I would like to emphasize every word of this part. It's 1 Corinthians 13, 4 to 8. Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, boast. It, it is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. Mashallah. These words are really very beautiful, very important. And this, there is a description here of love, which is unconditional love. Because if a person loves Allah, and if a person loves human beings, because he finds the manifestation of Allah in that person actually. That person should have this kind of a love in his heart because love is patient. So being patient is very important. If a person loves that person, then that love is patient. And when we are talking about marriages, we are always giving these details because in a marriage that is built for eternity actually that love is always patient even if a person is diseased that person never leaves love is kind and it does not envy envy in the ignorant communities actually they bring disasters to people because they say that that envy that jealousy results in murderers and that causes bloodshed in the societies and in pure love there is no envy and it does not boast and a person who has love for Allah is always in humility they are aware of their own deficiencies and their weakness and it is not proud it does not boast because a loving person always gives a loving person is always self-giving and shows altruistic behavior and finds the counterpart always superior than himself and it is not rude and being rude is a great problem in communities because not having love actually not experiencing this true love leads people to this kind of rudeness they have always a negative approach to one another because people are always seeking for love and they should be trying to find ways for increasing this love and also it is not self-seeking it is not easily angered it keeps no record of wrongs and love rejoices with the truth this means that people are always positive they always have a positive approach to one another and they live in great beauty this way and this way Muslims have this very pleasant way of living that that is described in the Quran and we ponder on uh, this beautiful unconditional love